Hey everybody, this is Ben coming to you on a rainy day with your tip of the week. With all the wet weather that we've had this spring, it seemed like a perfect time to talk about weather preparedness. I'm obviously here out on this rainy day standing under my umbrella to try to stay dry, and that's step number one. We have to stay dry in wet weather. I'm wearing a waterproof jacket, waterproof pants, waterproof shoes to prevent my feet from getting wet, and I typically wear a waterproof hat as well. What you want to look for in the shop is Gore-Tex. Gore-Tex will mean that there's a waterproof coating on the outside of all the materials. Here you can see our beautiful selection of wind and rain gear tailored specifically to your needs. Be sure to look for the waterproof seal of approval on the tag. Needless to say, anytime severe weather is in the area, you shouldn't be on the golf course at all. Although we do use weather sirens here at Worthington Hills, you should always use your best judgment when inclement weather is in the area. Never play when there is an immediate threat of lightning. And if something like this happens, call 911. Don't be like Carl. The next thing we want to do, which is arguably the most difficult thing to do, is to keep our hands dry. And if we can't keep our hands dry, then we want to keep them wet. And here's what I mean. Rain gloves are extremely useful for periods of heavy rain when you can't keep your hands dry. Simply wet the glove and it will be as tacky as a leather glove. I recommend wearing two to prevent your hands from slipping. So umbrellas are great for keeping things dry and not just yourself. You can also keep all your towels, gloves, and any other necessary items that you need to keep dry. The key is to create a nice cozy space underneath that umbrella where you can live while it rains. So I hope that helps you with your weather preparedness the next time you find yourself playing in the rain. Until next time.